This is how far I am from the house. It's burnt down so you can't see it, but I'm a good 300 yards from the house. Let's call it 200 to be generous. I'm in a debris field of things that were burning overnight. We're looking at large pieces of wood from the house. And if you think that's something, let me show you the other type of stuff that was blowing through here in addition to this debris. Do you see this? This is a piece of a solar panel. Now, to be clear, we are a solid 200 yards from the house. At the peak of this fire, my spouse and I came out to our field to make sure that pieces of debris this large were not setting the field on fire. And it is here that the Liberty County Sheriff's Department sought me out to tell me that I should not be here. Why? Because I had called 911 to say that this fire was so out of control that they needed to get the Georgia Forestry Commission involved. And do you know what the police officers told me when they followed me all the way here? Do you see the house? Do you see a perimeter? They told me that they would arrest me if I called 911 again. Now, what would you do if you were responsible for keeping this from catching on fire? And the police were so over, the fire department was so overwhelmed and so without water that they couldn't keep up with the fire. So what does a good citizen do? He comes out and finds burnt pieces of solar panel that have blown this far in this storm debris and tries to make sure that it's not setting the woods on fire. And what does the Liberty County Sheriff's Department do? In particular, the deputy and his supervisor, they harass me, tell me that they will call the police for being an active and caring citizen who is helping with a fire that completely outmanned five different firefighting units. You enjoying the view? Well, it's not a good view, and we can all thank God that this view isn't burnt. Because would you look at a number like this? Do you know what this could have done to your house if it burned its way over there?